Make sure you guys smash that subscribe button if you guys are fans of the content being posted onto this channel to always be in the loop with more content similar to this and be sure to hit the video up with a like if you're enjoying the content and with that being said, let's begin. After having to follow the events of what was supposed to be one of the most anticipated horror movies of its time, Jeepers Creepers 3, many of the fans of both horror and Jeepers Creepers are now seemingly begging the question, when exactly are they going to follow up in concluding the overall franchise with a fourth installment, but also bidding their farewell as after watching Jeepers Creepers 3 universally, fans can come to agree that Jeepers Creepers 3 was by far the absolute worst Jeepers Creepers movie within the overall franchise. And that's not really saying much considering the fact that Jeepers Creepers 3 takes place in between Jeepers Creepers 1 and 2. By the end of Jeepers Creepers 3, we do have ourselves a little bit of a sneak peek as to what may occur in the fourth installment, but after everything that's transpired involving the movie itself, the director, the budgets, the actors, the actresses, one happens to beg the question if a fourth movie is even going to be made to begin with. As back in August of 2018, I made a video basically explaining my thoughts on Jeepers Creepers 4 having to be the final movie within the franchise, and how I personally think by having the franchise be bought out and possibly rebooted would not only be the best course of action in having to take a different direction for the franchise, but also going as far as to revitalize the franchise, which I do believe the overall series so desperately needs. And that video in and of itself in August of 2018 generated well over 210,000 views. But now here we are today in the modern setting and I do believe that going forward there should not be a Jeepers Creepers 4 movie. If they do plan on actually giving us a final movie for Jeepers Creepers, which of course there are rumors going around that not only do they have Jeepers Creepers 4 in mind but a possible TV series and a fifth movie going forward, I do believe believe that going forward to further preserve the already tarnished reputation that is of Jeepers Creepers, either they give us a fourth definitive movie that basically encompasses everything we've seen in Jeepers Creepers 1, 2, and 3, and nailing that final nail within the coffin of Jeepers Creepers in allowing it to be bought off later on, possibly by Blumhouse, Lionsgate, or whatever other company wants to take in such a franchise like this, because I think universally speaking, we can all agree that Jeepers Creepers, the franchise franchise of Jeepers Creepers has a lot of potential in being one of the absolute best horror franchises within cinema today. Of course, an iconic character, a very intriguing plot, and many other elements that do make for a great movie, but with the director Victor Salva having to have a huge blemish on his name, that in and of itself smears the overall legacy of what once was considered to be one of the best horror movies of its time back in the early 2000s. Now for me, if they're going to make a Jeepers Creepers 4 movie, one of two things needs to happen. Either A, have Trisha and the other remaining survivors of the events following Jeepers Creepers 1 and 2 finally put down the Creeper in ending his life, dismembering him, doing whatever they need to do to re-ensure that the Creeper does not reawaken 23 years from now, of course, to feast once again and having to finally write off the Creeper for good and having him be killed off. Or, they can go with option B and have the Creeper kill off Trisha, have the Creeper kill off the remaining survivors and continuing his legacy and continuing to feast every 23 years for 23 days and continuing that legacy for the Creeper itself. And once Jeepers Creepers 4 is over and done with, which I do believe they ought to pour all of their eggs into that one basket and giving us the holy grail of Jeepers Creepers movies, the movie that we've been asking for for many, many years. After that, I do believe that what Victor Salva should do going forward is sell the international property rights is to sell the overall franchise of Jeepers Creepers to a different company, a different director, producer, whoever, whatever he needs to do to rid himself of the title Jeepers Creepers. Why? Because can you imagine if Blumhouse, Lionsgate, or a different company of that nature, of that magnitude that has the budget, buys out Jeepers Creepers and reboot the franchise in their own image that can give us not only a film that can creep us out and scare us, but a good Jeepers Creepers movie very easily really similar to what we've gotten in the first movie. Which of course one can make the argument in saying that Jeepers Creepers 1 was by far the best Jeepers Creepers movie among the three, which is universal at this point considering its atmosphere, its tone, and its overall character direction. I do believe that once Jeepers Creepers 4 is done, which of course we all already know that it is coming, it's just a matter
matter of timing, we have seen reports be given to us before that Jeepers Creepers 4 is set to portray Trisha's changed life and feature a bit of flashbacks from the events of Jeepers Creepers 1, 2, and 3 in the movie, which, again, is very subjective in its overall selection of what they choose to do for the movie, but it's universal at this point that the title of Jeepers Creepers will never succeed underneath the banner of Victor Salva. Why? Because of his record, the allegations made against him, and even what he's done time for in the children that he has assaulted and attacked before is what will drag this film down. I think a lot of us do want to see Jonathan Breck reprise his role as the Creeper going forward for a different company, because can you imagine how awesome the Creeper would be if the film in and of itself had a ridiculously high budget in comparison to what we've seen before? The overall level of detail, the overall settings, the landscape, the characters, the introduction they could do by reimagining what Jeepers Creepers is, is what I think the best course of action should be going forward after Jeepers Creepers 4 is over and done with. As I do want to get your thoughts in the comment section below because the community matters, you the fans matter, the fans of this movie matter, because the question is, if you could help change this movie, and if you can allow this movie to profit and succeed in becoming one of the best horror movies of its time, what would you do to save Jeepers Creepers? That is the question that I beg to you, the viewers, in asking you, what would you do to save the franchise? Because a lot of people do have very different subjective opinions as to kill the Creeper, let the Creeper survive, reboot the franchise, remake the franchise, allow Victor Salva to continue in making a Jeepers Creepers 5, 6, 7, 8. Some people might beg to differ in allowing it to become a TV show, so everybody does have a different opinion as to what they want to do. But even now, when looking at it, they ruined the Jeepers Creepers. Jeepers Creepers 3 was supposed to be the sequel that we've all been waiting for ever since Jeepers Creepers 2. We've all often wondered what happened, what happened to the creeper, what happened to the old man and his son, what happened to the survivors, what happened after Jeepers Creepers 2, but instead, rather than us the fans getting what we've been asking for ever since Jeepers Creepers 2, what we ended up getting instead was a movie in between 1 and 2 that virtually made absolutely zero sense. If anyone out there can give me a cognitive reason as to why Jeepers Creepers 3 made any sense for the franchise, let me know in the comments comment section below because I think I speak on behalf of many when I say Jeepers Creepers 3, what we've gotten from that movie was not needed at all because nothing tied in to any of the other movies other than the fact that we understand there was a piece of the Creeper that he didn't want exposed to the public and then once people found out what his supposed weakness was, the movie just fell flat from there. So again, the movie offered nothing in terms of substance, there was no world building or character development at all, which led ultimately ultimately to an absolutely shitty movie which everyone hated universally. And yes, for those that do enjoy Jeepers Creepers 2 a lot more than 3, I don't blame you, actually I stand with you in that fact because what they did with Jeepers Creepers 3, in my opinion, was a simple and quick cash grab. That was it. There was no substance, there was no lore building, there was no quality behind the movie itself, everything was rushed, the events presented made absolutely to little sense at all, nobody cared about the characters, nobody even cared that much about the Creeper to begin with, so what they should do, what Victor Salva and his team should do for Jeepers Creepers 4 is learn from the criticism, learn from the mistakes of Jeepers Creepers 3. Go back and listen to your customers, go back and listen to the consumer, and take a little look at what the criticisms are for Jeepers Creepers 3, and correct that going forward into Jeepers Creepers 4. It's not that difficult to do. Which I do also want to let you guys know that just because Jeepers Creepers 3 was utter garbage does not mean that Jeepers Creepers 4 is going to be garbage, because if there is some sense of a change, and if they do end up listening to the fans and improving in terms of quality, and direction, story narratives, etc, etc, then Jeepers Creepers 4 could possibly be the best movie within the franchise, or we can go down the dark road of having that movie be the absolute worst of the worst, which makes Jeepers Creepers 3 look like an absolute cakewalk in comparison to the fourth movie. But it's not impossible, it's not impossible to have Jeepers Creepers be redeemed, but that's ultimately up to the directors, producers, company, corporations, whoever's behind the film, which I do believe after Victor Salva they so desperately need to do, but by the end of it, I want to get your thoughts in the comment section below about Jeepers Creepers 4 and what you guys 
guys think would be the overall best thing for them to do taking the movie taking the product and going forward do you guys see a possible reboot a remake a tv series do you see a potential fifth movie coming out of this i really want to know your thoughts down below thank you all so much for watching guys once more if you guys are new to the channel don't forget to smash that subscribe button if you guys want to see a good jeepers creepers movie hopefully with jc4 then be sure to go on ahead and slap a big fat like down below and give this video a thumbs up if you guys are fans of the jeepers creepers franchise but also want to see a good movie down the line because i think that's ultimately what we're all asking for here is for a good movie nobody here is asking for avengers endgame quality nobody here is asking for some you know extra detailed and like produced movie no all we're asking for is a good movie with a solid narrative and good production behind it in wrapping the franchise up finally before being passed down to a different company or a different producer slash director. So again, drop your thoughts in the comment section below. Thank you all so much for watching, guys. Once more, we're going to have more Jeepers Creepers videos in the foreseeable future. So again, make sure you guys tune back in for that, and I'll be seeing you all down in the comment section below. Have a great day, guys. Peace.